everyone um i'm doing this with my new phone so i hope you can see me proper at least i i think i can see myself so i think it'll be fine but i just wanted to know how you're doing with weight loss if you've had a baby or you've not had a baby you just have those extra pounds to shed i mean not as in pounds sterling but i mean like pound pound fat um anyway it's my fourth baby and um my body is very different I mean, I did a lot of exercise this time and that really helped me with the birth and I find my body springing back, but the scale is not really moving, um, I would say. I don't think it's one of those, oh, don't worry, you're adding muscles and stuff like that. No, I think the fat is still there. I would normally lose weight when I finish breastfeeding, which would normally be like when my baby is six months and stuff like that. So we'll see anyway, but I don't think I can carry this weight anymore because it's just so many kilograms. I mean, I lost a lot of weight when I had the baby. I lost 7 kg, um, well, maybe two weeks afterward, afterwards, after, after the baby. But oh, I can see the scale is going up. Um, it's the late night eating, waking up to breastfeed and then eating and stuff like that. So it's different. What I don't want is to, you know, lose sight of my body. I'm not a body, body fanatic. I'm not someone who thinks, oh, I have to be a size eight or a particular size, a particular weight. No, but I know when my body is right. I know when I feel good in myself and I think health is wealth and I think it's important to actually think of what we put in our mouths even though i don't really think about it anyway i try to do more exercise than diets don't get me wrong i eat well i eat well but i eat too many carbs i know what my problem is is portion sizes so what are you doing about your portion sizes especially if you're breastfeeding i'm not taking anything out of my diet because my baby's quite young and i like to breastfeed proper you know enough breast milk i never like breast milk i eat enough to feed but i also do not want to be a size i don't know finish by the time i stop breastfeeding and then it becomes too difficult to lose the weight so i've done um some exercise today um i've got insanity i've got t25 and all of that on dvd but I just thought I'll spice some, some you know, I'll spice it up. So I went for Gillian Michaels' um, um, workout, and I think this is the fourth one I've done. And whoa, I love it! I think it's a kickboxing one that I've done. But I love, I love the thirty day shred and stuff like that. So if you don't have enough money to buy the DVDs and stuff, I've actually gotten this one on the internet, and it was really good. You know, just challenging myself, and I hope you do too. So let me know how it's going for you. I mean, my body is so different. When I was pregnant, I was fitting into my own clothes. I had no need for new clothes but I've noticed that every time I have a baby I have the weight or the fat stored in some funny places that means my body shape is I don't want to say altered I'd rather say different well I hope I'm looking into the camera the right way because I'm not very sure how to use this anyway but I'm doing a lot of works so walking to the kids school and stuff like that I've had to buy a whole new wardrobe, please, it's, it's, it's funny, it's, um, I don't want to say crazy, I've been to the shop and the lady was looking at me like, you don't have problems, do you? This is actually the fourth batch, i just show you it's in the background, that it's oh, what my shopping looks like, it's a lot of next stuff everywhere, next, 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 and it's loads and loads, unending, unending, unending. But this is one of the things that happens when you have to buy new, um, or rather, when you add so much weight, you have to buy new stuff. It's not funny, it's a lot of money, and oh, I think this is one of the things I'm trying to avoid. Because if I have all this clothes, then what am I going to do when I shrink back into my normal size anyway we'll see i'm not too worried i've never had a problem wearing big clothes anyway i don't really wear clothes to fit i just wear clothes that i'm well comfortable in and i can wear to work and stuff like that so i've got um a nutri bullet my husband bought me i had one of those other ones but he wasn't really liquidizing the food proper 
So I get my nutrients in, I just buy bags and bags of solids and I mix them with maybe watermelon or with my protein shake. And then I have a protein bar and then I try to get in my workouts at least 20 minutes. T25 by Shanti is 25 minutes. Um, I think we can put, you know, 25 minutes into our busy schedules. But pff, I know it's not all the time because sometimes I get so tired, you know, and I have so much to do except for the kids. I still, I'm still working. So anyway, that's what it is. I wish you all the best and I'm just going to continue to give you progress reports and if you have um, any encouragement or you have something to share that you've done to lose weight as a breastfeeding mother I would love to hear from you I've seen a lot of videos up there and it might just be you know that you have something someone recommended a tea to me on YouTube um, I haven't tried that but um, I've tried a particular tea, I'm not going to call the name except you want to know what that is and I can let you know but I don't think it was the right tea because I feel like my baby had trapped wind afterwards, mm, I'm not sure but I don't think I want to experiment with my, with my daughter. So anyway it is what it is and I'll see you later, keep kicking, keep moving, keep eating less and will feel very well soon and if you're not pregnant or, or rather if you've not just had a baby or you're trying to lose weight then I wish you all the best to you. Cheers. Take care.